Hi, this is Brendan Howe here from Techify with a very serious cybersecurity message today. In fact, this should be a wake up call for CEOs, whether you're running a business or a nonprofit, the Russia Ukraine situation has amped up cybersecurity threats at an unprecedented level. In 14 years at this business, I've never seen anything like what we're seeing these days with the number of threats out there and the concern of business owners. The main message that I want you to take away today is if you're not cranking up your cybersecurity at your organization, you should be. If it's not going up a notch or two, well, you're gonna be falling behind. The government through the communication security establishment is warning businesses that the threat level is getting higher and higher, particularly because of what's going on in the Ukraine. Tons of businesses are investing in improving their cybersecurity. And if you're not investing, if you're not improving your cybersecurity, that means you're going to be a soft target. You're gonna be left behind. When the hackers out there look for businesses to attack, they look for vulnerabilities, you're gonna be, you're gonna be the softest target. So crank it up a notch. The BBC came out with a report, 74% of ransomware revenue money goes to Russia. 74% of the money coming from ransomware proceeds are, are going to Russia. We're gonna see a continued escalation of ransomware and other malware. So what can you do about it? Well, there's some basics you need to have in place. Number one, a process that runs on a consistent basis. You should be auditing your technology and your cybersecurity against best practices. That continued process should lead to a cybersecurity roadmap where every quarter you're improving your cybersecurity, that you have a roadmap for the next 12 months and you know what the plan is, you know what that next step is. At, at, at a very kind of basic level, if you don't have multi-factor authentication in place on your network right now, you are going to get hacked. It's not a matter of if, it's a matter of when. Multi-factor authentication needs to be in place. So once you have that in place, you should be looking at your backups. Do you have cloud and on-premise based backups that are ransomware proof? Are those in place? If those are in place, great. Look at your remote access. Are you still using VPN? If you're using VPN, that's a big red flag. There's much more secure remote access technologies available out there that are much less susceptible to cyber attacks. And last but definitely not least, if you have some of those basics already in place, then your next step is look at more advanced cloud-based security methods. You can lock down access to your files, to your network based on location, based on devices, so that people in different parts of the world can access your systems. There's lots of things that you can do. It's not that expensive, but you gotta do it you got to look at it. So hopefully this is a wake, wake up call for you. I hope every quarter you're improving your cybersecurity. And if you're not doing it now, it's time to start. Don't say it's inconvenient. It's a lot more inconvenient to get hacked and have your business go down. There's a lot of businesses and livelihoods at stake here. If you need help, reach out. If you're not getting good advice, reach out to us. We'll help you out. We'll, we'll give you the guidance on what you should be looking at from your cybersecurity roadmap. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.